Recently, I started providing construction site monitoring and at times my clients will be on site while I'm running a mission and they'll want to see what I'm seeing with my drone. So they'll lean over my shoulder and watch on my RC Pro screen. Wanting to prevent them from having to do this and also give them a better view, I came up with the following solution. Hey, welcome back everyone. It's Joe from Ghost1917. This is going to be a super short video showing you how I solved the client over the shoulder problem when performing on-site missions. I saw a couple of people had set up external monitors for showing clients their work and I wanted to do something similar but most used a large monitor or a small monitor in a Pelican case and all needed an external power source and utilized the HDMI output on the RC Pro. So I did some searching and found this a 15 and a half inch portable monitor which can run on USB power. It's an off-brand monitor which I picked up for just about 70 bucks. Instead of plugging it into the HDMI output, I plugged it into the USB-C input output and voila, I had streaming 1080p video from my RC Pro. For those of you who may be concerned about the power consumption, I ran five missions on site for a total of just under 30 minutes flight time and at the end of the five missions, I had 81% power remaining on the RC Pro. So it doesn't appear that the external monitor is an excessive power drain on the RC Pro's battery. I'm currently using my Air 2S for all of my construction jobs and I still use my Low Pro BP250 Drone Guard backpack to transport my equipment. And the backpack pocket where I store my landing pad has just enough room to store my new monitor. I simply slip out the monitor, unfold it, and plug it into my RC Pro. And I have streaming video, which my clients can view without even looking over my shoulder. I really love the portability of it and the fact that I could run it off of the power from my RC Pro. As always, I'd love to hear from you. Let me know in the comment section below if you use an external monitor while using your RC Pro, and if so, what kind of setup you have. And while you're down there, make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on future videos. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.